Gateshead, of course, on a good run at the moment. With the victory, today, Gateshead could be uh, eight points clear of the relegation zone. And that is a massive shot in the arm. If you go back six, seven weeks, you are five points adrift at one point. Just stops the ball, plays it across to... He's got a chance here to drive forward. To Whelan. Whelan's got space. He's still got loads of space. Out to Ollie. Ollie now. Two men closing him down inside to Francis. Francis is going to put it in to Conta. Conta takes a touch, puts it back out to Ollie. Lovely stuff. Can we get a delivery into the box? Comes to Dinanga. He's held it up. Oh, he rolls it to Conta. Can he get a space to open himself up? Shot. Oh, oh over the ball. Balance. He was leaning back when he hit it. And the space was there. And it's just Gates had starting to find it a little bit more of ease. I think just at the very last second there, Cameron Conte has just panicked a little bit and tried to get the shot away, possibly a little bit quicker than he had to. I don't think he thought the defender was going to slip. Well, they're building out from the back, uh, Scunthorpe, and they're doing themselves no favours there. That There isn't anyone going wide to receive the ball. How good's that partnership been in the field, by the way? Oh, Whelan and Francis, it's uh, really clicked as Ward drives forward. Still Good. going Conta, everyone's seeing shoot but Werns out here, lovely nice. vision, can he pull it back across? He can, oh, oh it stayed in, now it comes back across, Ollie chests it down, shot, back of the net! The captain does it again, and Gator take the lead against Scunthorpe. Brilliant finish, I'll tell you what, credit Stephen Wern because he's picked out a brilliant ball there. He, had time, he could have panicked, he could have just lashed out across goal, you can see it's a purposeful pass. He's picked out Greg Ollie, it's a great cross, great first touch, and what a finish as well, because I think that's possibly the only place he could have put that to finish it. Certainly did, well, 18 minutes gone, Gates had won, Scunthorpe nil, and I think there might be an injured player for Scunthorpe. Richard Ever uh, Everton puts it out to the far side. Number 29, still Ken. Well... Ball across to Feeney, who's sitting increasingly deeper as the game goes on. Conta comes no in, no, no foul. foul. Ball to Denanga. He's going to get there. Richards has got uh, Richard Everton is going to get in front of him. But that is a poor, poor bit of defending. He won the ball. He should have been able to control that. Quick one. Oh, quickly taken. D Conta to Wern. Wern full of confidence, running at the defence, cuts inside. Can he lay it off? He's still got the ball. Oh. Lovely stuff to Ollie. Back to Wern. Oh, what a goal! Beautiful goal! goal. What a goal! Beautiful! The link up what play inside the box. The quickly taken throw in. And Gateshead, well, the man that started it, finished it. That is absolutely stunning football from Gateshead. Stephen Wern, Conta, great combination. Lovely ball back to him. It looks a simple ball, but the ball back from Ollie. He doesn't have to break strides, Stephen Wern. It's such a lovely finish. A lot of players would have just lashed at that, but he's just calmly stroked it beyond uh, Tom Bilson. You know, Gates have deserved this lead. They've been far the better side. And, uh, well, as, as said by well, the Twitter account during the week, by the way, it looks like Mike's entertaining us a back. They certainly are. And uh, we're into the 34th minute. We scored in the 33rd. Wow. Story goes oh, for a ball over oh, the oh, top oh. towards Oli, brings it down. Oh, oh and Lee oh, had to be there. Oh, and bad from Bilson. Conta nods the header, couldn't direct it towards the Gator player. And Scunthorpe can try and clear the ball good now, ball. as now That's Feeney good, has it. Really There's options in front of him. Whelan closes him down. Good stuff from Gateshead, and they're going to win the ball. But it falls back to a yellow shirt. But they pick it up now. Conta. Dinanga's in front of him, he's still going Conta. Pew Jesus. brings him down. Oh, it's got to be a book. Oh, oh, and that was a kick, and that surely has to be a red card. He's, he's off. What an idiot. What an but idiot. Tom Pew, there was a tussle, it was awkward, but there was no need to kick a player when he's on the ground, and Idiotic. he has done his team no favours. Do you know what? When you're at the bottom of the league, when you're struggling the way Scun thought bar, you have to make good decisions. He has made an abysmal one there. It's idiotic. I don't know what he's doing. It was There's a no need to kick out. It's. Uh, I think they really need to get someone upside uh, next to Danny Elliott because you, you look at the bench and you could see, um, you know, someone like Marcus Carver come on. Short corner, oh, uh, put across now. Wheel on the edge of the box. <laughs> it always looked like he's he was going to tee it up. Tempted. Pie back to Tinkler. Everyone in the last third of the pitch. Bar Marshall. There isn't Marshall, who I found out from his, his mum and dad. Pi, though. Oh, 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 oh! oh. <laughs> I thought it, I think it hit, just clipped off the ball, off the uh, woodwork there. Yeah, just given so much time, he probably could have taken it even closer, you know, because he's not closed down. 
Um, you know, Scunthorpe are looks as they're going to try and play off from the back again, which they are. Well, oh, good touch. a lovely touch there from Leek. Leek driving with the ball here down the left-hand side. He's still going, but he's got three shirts around him. And Ward just comes in sneakily like a sniper and takes it away. And then Gateshead can pass it around and try and get themselves out of trouble here as Ward plays it into the oh, centre. It's a good ball, you know. High can get it to Conta. And now Gates is on the break. Ollie right-hand side, Wern left. You've got Morton in the centre. Conta puts it out to Wern now, who... Tries to get it across and goes for a shot. There's Tinkler, acres of space, acres. He has options to his right, puts it in there. Oh, oh Martin just couldn't ball. get the connection. What a ball that is, by oh, the way. Oh, it just whizzed through. Martin made the right run and just couldn't get a lace on it. It's a brilliant ball, isn't it? Brilliant ball. Oh. Plays it to Tinkler. Ollie oh, on the inside on. Oh, Lovely touch. touch. Lays it off to Whelan. Gets it to Aaron Martin, who lays it off and turned. Couldn't get it to a shirt, but falls to a great shirt now. Ball across to Ward. Can he keep it in? He can. Come across from at some speed. Now to Ollie. Martin and Ward in the middle. Francis lays it to Tinkler just passing it around hoping for the space to appear Tinkler now has Ollie Ollie gets it through the legs fortunately is it going to fall to a gated player nice no, it comes away the and man. now Leek can oh, what, a tackle. what a tackle what a from tackle Robbie Tinkler is, and Gated on the attack Ward right hand side of the box he's got Martin to aim for he's got a few odds lays off to Conta oh, oh good, good save. save good save but Conta can go and retrieve the ball on the left hand side Pie, Pie back to story, and once again, Gates had just calmly build again. There's just no need to rush. No, nope. no need to rush. Story, oh, okay, he's driving well. forward, gets it to Ollie. Ollie's got it's Ward here on well. the right hand side, goes inside Ward, he's still going. Can he get the shot off? Oh, oh it's the woodwork! Beautiful stuff! And I tell you what, if a man deserved a goal, it would have been him today. He's been doing some lovely stuff on the right hand side. He has, he's had a great game, Dan Ward. His work rate's been phenomenal. He's done that little cut inside a few times, you know, and Scunthorpe just haven't read it, but what a strike with his left foot. As Gateshead is comfortably play the ball around the back, and there is the full-time whistle. Gateshead run out in dominant fashion here at Gateshead Stadium. 2-0, Greg Ollie and Wern with the goals. Fine goals, but a fine confidence, and uh, not confident, of just... The words I'm looking for escape is at the moment because it was just so divine. It was, a, it was a lovely, yep. It's a professional display from Gator. They've done what they had to do. They've kept the clean sheet. They've limited chances. And they're, they're punished in opposition that have kind of dealt themselves their own blow. They certainly did. Of course, the red card of Tom Pugh in the first half was really the nail in the coffin. It looked that way. Gator were already finding space in the first half. But they've went out. They've done their job professionally. They've kept themselves